Global climate change is today's most pressing issue and most Indians favor taking meaningful actions. Buildings are alone responsible for 40% of total energy used in India. Zero energy homes are one of the cornerstones of a reduced carbon future that is not reliant on fossil fuels. With zero energy home, you can control where your home's energy comes from with every flip of light switch every single day. This zero energy project is here to connect you with resources and empower you to take action. The project is located in the GIFT city of Gujarat, one of the first IGBC platinum rated city in India. The city is well planned, smart technology enabled city over 886 acres of land. It is located on the bank of River Sabarmati, connecting the business capital Ahmedabad and the political capital Gandhinagar of Gujarat state. Our project falls under a hot and dry climate zone with a site area of 4,790 square meters. We aim at achieving a sustainable and a net zero multifamily housing in Ahmedabad, Gujarat, which is suitable for a hot and dry climate of this region. We plan to produce a housing which exceeds the minimum nominal quality standards. In order to achieve a net zero building, we have worked under the innovation and architecture, energy performance, thermal comfort and environmental quality, resilience, water and waste management, scalability and affordability of the structure. Our design approach has been to maximize natural lighting and natural ventilation. It was important to make the apartments responsive to the harsh hot and dry climate. By orienting them in a manner that allows cross ventilation and planning for units per floor, the apartments get windows on two sides while living spaces get views in both directions. A naturally ventilated central service core joins the three apartments. To support the energy requirements, renewable energy sources that include rooftop solar panels and on-site biogas are proposed. The services in the building run entirely on the solar energy. The building is resilient to natural and man-made disasters, making it ready for future adaptability. The facade of the building was designed to be dynamically responsive to the climate and the preference and usage patterns of the owners. A system of sliding louvered screens are proposed at the periphery of verandas and openings on either face of the blocks. These can be moved to allow increased solar penetration in winter months or spread out to create shading devices during harsh summers. Also adding the vegetation helped in reducing the heat gains and cooling the air entering the room. Windows were provided with louvered shading devices and a window elevation which is combination of louvered and glazed panels to maximize the river view at the same time filter the sun radiation and controlling the amount of air. The rainwater is harvested and the water cycle is maintained to treat and reuse the wastewater. We have been able to achieve 85% of water autonomy in our project. The design process was developed with a data-driven integrated design approach by a multidisciplinary team from building science, architecture and engineering disciplines along with the technical support of our industry partners. The entire project is a comprehensive approach towards initiating a change and amplifying the concept of net zero.